Hey guys, Bradham73 here. Welcome back to Construction Simulator as we continue on with the train station extension. Uh, I believe I can fly. Uh, no, I don't even believe that. I think we're going to be in the tower crane putting up all of these ceiling bits, roof bits. But it's almost dark time. It's almost... Hold on, let me get my mic moved over here. It's almost the time of darkness in which we must move into the coffee break and eateth of the donuts. Um, oh, way down here. <laughs> Don't hit the columns! Feel like I need this one. I need it. Maybe I don't. That did not go where I. That did not go how I planned. Actually, recording this did not go how I planned. I was actually going to. Um, Record this afternoon. I don't know why I slept. It took me so long to fall asleep last night and I just I ended up getting up this morning eating breakfast. I was really tired and Then my printer, you know my printer that I told you guys about Well, it was supposed to show up today Apparently that does not go there and it goes over here. Um, so the way Amazon day shipping works, not Amazon day, but Amazon day shipping is you get a, you get a credit back when you use it, but Amazon kind of determines the best time to deliver it. So, you know, last night it was saying, well, it will be delivered before 10 p.m. <laughs> and I'm like, well, I know it'll be before then because they've they've rarely delivered anything that late. There, there maybe like one time I got something at like nine o'clock or nine thirty. I've actually had things delivered at like four fifteen in the morning, and they've actually rang my doorbell for it, <laughs> and they're like. Sorry to wake you up, sir. Um, but anyway, yeah, so they were like, you know, I, I woke up at like 8 o'clock. I looked at my phone. It didn't have a time as to, um, you know, when it was going to be delivered. And so, well, it's, it, well, it still said before 10 p.m. And so I was like, okay. So then I... Went back to sleep because I don't think I fell asleep until I don't know three or maybe even four a.m. this morning. I just I was tossing and turning. I maybe I was excited to get my new printer. I don't know. Of all things to be excited about. So at about eleven o'clock this morning. I, ooh, I finally got a message. Okay, we're, ooh, I got it done right in time for it to go full dark. So let's take our coffee break. So yeah, at about 11 o'clock, it said it was going to get delivered between 2 p.m. and 4 p.m. And so I was up for a while, but I was really tired. And so I was like, I'm going to take a nap from about 1 until 2. So 2 p.m. comes along, no updates, 2.15, so I, you know, I'm like setting the, what is it, the, um, the snooze, <laughs> the snooze button on my phone. My phone doesn't really have a snooze button, but you know what I'm talking about. And so, uh, so I'm hit, I'm hitting snooze, hitting snooze, hitting snooze. 
I want to see where these go. So, like, every eight minutes, it wakes me up. Oh, it goes right in the middle. Nope. Oh, no. Uh, well, I didn't mean to do that. So yeah, I think that I think it snoozes for eight minutes, and then it's like time to get up, Brad. Beer, 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 beep, 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 beep. And so, um, so yeah, I kept getting up. Then it got pushed to like two thirty to four thirty. So you know, two o'clock came and went. What the heck am I doing? But anyway, finally at about 3.30, I think it was a little after 3.30, they finally delivered it. <clears throat> and uh, I was as happy as a little girl. Okay, those go over there. Um... I feel like I need to be putting these down. So I mean, like getting the getting the printer set up and everything was fine. Ah. And um got some test prints. I got to say I'm like initially very pleased. Uh I hate when they have the the little targeting thing wrong. So yeah, I was kind of playing around with my printer and trying to figure out how to get it to set up. Um, I still haven't scanned anything with it, so I'm gonna. I guess I'll have to try that tomorrow. But yeah, so far so good. I'm gonna have to get some like laser jet quality um, laser, like like photo paper, because I tried printing a photo on inkjet photo paper and it did not like that at all. Like smeared all the toner. And at first I was like, I just screwed my printer up. But no, it's it was fine. There, now we're kind of doing what I need to do. Ooh, way in the back. Swing! What is what it where does this go? If it goes over here, oh it goes right there. I'm gonna guess that these are gonna go in the back. Yep. Perfect.
Ugh. Uh, see, I feel like they put these pieces backwards, but whatever. Whatever. Okay, three more to go. And the last one. Boom. <sighs> Perfect time to take a sip of coffee. Oh, that's the rebar. Oh, okay, never mind. I was thinking to myself, why am I still seeing rebar in the corners and stuff? And it's just because it's probably that wall rebar. Okay, we're almost out on this tank.
41 percent. Seven, so we're almost halfway done with this pad or this roof segment, I guess. Fifty percent. I feel like I'm going too fast. Hey, boy, slow down. Ah, <laughs> uh, can't do it. Hey, boy, I can't do my Mr. T impression. Now I feel obligated to go more slowly. Seventy four. <clears throat> We're pretty much at max extension for the most part. Yeah, like right there. Now I wonder if we're gonna bunk into these rebar segments or if it's gonna treat them as invisible. Yeah, invisible, 95, oh man. To, we're gonna have to move. And actually, um, where are they? Are they still over here? My my buckets. Yeah, they're right here. Um, Cause these don't work like normal pieces of equipment, I don't think. Cause you can't get into them. So. I don't even, I don't know if they show up in the vehicle fleet. Yeah, they don't. So, yeah, it's just going to be... It's not going to matter if I...
if I go pick them up with this, you know, like with the dump, well, with the flatbed or not. Now I feel like I may need I wonder if this is even going to work. Yep, okay. Okay. Thirteen what? Oh. Okay, got to lift up a little bit there. I imagine I'm going to have to move the arm down to the end. Yeah, this arm doesn't... <clears throat> I remember in the, the last, uh, was it the museum extension where we were moving left and right? And then I was like, oh, wait, these actually were going, you know, straight out and back. This, this pump tr truck, I think, works better going side to side. I just think that it does. Hey, it's falling through the floor, not fair. Is there a little bit? Okay. All right. <clears throat> so let's go up around the corner here. We'll finish this off. I have a feeling that there's going to be another wall segment over here, so we'll see what happens there. Uh, okay, good deal.
And 100, okay. So wait, there's more ceiling concrete elements? Okay. And it looks like some stairs. <clears throat> This next one's going to be even harder to get in, so let's, um... Let's do it. That's all we can do. Now, I don't see where the stairs go in. Unless they're going to go in by that elevator shaft or something. Perfect. Ugh. Now where do these stairs go? Um, great. Wah! Okay, well, it is what it is. We need to drive elsewhere. I wonder if I can drive up onto this. I can't believe it, but it, it does work. Whoa. Okay. There's the stairs. All right, let's see what's going to happen. Do they actually put free... Pre Preformed stairs in like this? I 
I've personally never seen them. I've always seen them formed on site, but I don't know. Not really in the construction industry, just like when I've seen buildings being built in the past. Excavate found no Excavate foundation for what and where what Um, how are, How are we even gonna get well, I guess there's a little I guess we're gonna give it the old college try. How's that? It's gonna be dark here in a moment. Oh wait, no, it's like a whole hour. It's gonna take us a whole hour to drive around there. Is this for like a... Like a bridge or something that goes over to a restaurant? I don't know. See the top right side above the bear face or whatever that's supposed to be? See like the polar bear face right there at the top of the, <laughs> the crane's arm? where all the windows are, sometimes that'll be like a little cafeteria or something, you know, where you can sit, watch the trains come in and go out, I guess. I don't know. Uh, I'll be honest, I was not expecting there to be another digging job I just I hope a train doesn't come overnight because we're gonna get smushed Awesome. Whoa, that's super duper bright.
You know what I actually might need to do? I might need to get one of the small wheeled excavators, which we have sold. Or, well, we didn't sell them, we just... Let's see, Sani. So there's the compact excavator. That's not the one I want. I want the one that's got the wide... Yeah, this guy. I guess I'll just fast travel. Ring! I can't even see where I'm going. Can I even drive around to the opposite side? Looking too bad down there. I think we probably maybe need to <laughs> empty out the flatbed, but we don't really because we don't. Nice and slow. Did we even get any... Per Let's see, we're at 74. Seventy nine.
84. So we're getting about five a scoop. 5%. 87, not on that one. Still 89. See, I think... Whoops, let's go into drive mode. If I can back that in a little closer. Nope, I guess that's about as close as I could go. Um, all right. In that case, oh, ninety nine per cent. Boom, there we go. Clear the Marteria. <laughs> no, okay. Um, ba -ba -ba, ba -ba 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 -ba. how many of these are we going to have to do like all the way down this ramp or what I, I bet this is for some kind of roofing Oh, how much time do I have left? Oh, we got about 15 minutes. Yeah, I think this uh, cat excavator definitely works best for this job. Oh, 
Oh, see, that's dirt. So this appears to all be gravel on the top and then it's like dirt <clears throat> dirt below the gravel and we don't get anything for that. Let's switch over. We'll empty this guy. We got 3,000 something for that. Not bad. So now we still have a lot of cleanup. Seventy one per cent. Nothing for that. Eighty eight. Let's go back into driving mode. I'm just going to move over to the right a little ways. Ninety-seven. We're almost there. And then we're gonna have to do an another one, and then another one, and then another one, and then. No, I don't know. Hopefully not. Oh my gosh. Thirty-eight. 
Thank Gersh. I was afraid of that. I'm gonna see if I can scooch in a little bit more here. I bet I'm going to have to go all the way down and dig all of this out. Uh, see, that's like... It's like I have to see if it fills up as dirt or gravel. So there's dirt. Dirt. Pretty sure that's dirt, though I don't know why everything's so flipping dark all of a sudden. Can barely see what I'm doing. Ah! And that was gravel. Why is it so. Oh, it's because I lost my headlights. That looks like soil. No. Stop it. There we go. Now that's gravel, so let's... I'm going to scooch back over to the left now. We're at 62% done. So, I don't know. We'll check our t we'll check the time after I'm done with this one. I think I think I'm out of time. Gravel. Dirtario. Seventy seven percent complete. No.
80. Ninety four. Ninety three. We actually dug dirt out, but put dirt back in. marked area okay I shall do that and then I shall get out of black and white mode here oh it's showing the whole area see the blue I think we oh no <laughs> why all right what's the time we are right at 59 minutes right now um, so, let's go ahead. We're going to clean this up. Looks like we got some spillage there. I guess we're going to have to... So, we one, two, three, four. There's probably going to be six of these. I'm guessing we're at least going to dig two more. One and then another one. But I'm, I'd almost say three. So, I don't know. We'll have to come back in the next episode and find out. Um, so, stay tuned. Be sure to hit that like button if you're following along with the train station extension build. Uh, leave a comment. Let me know how I'm doing. Let me know how you are doing. And if you haven't done so, please subscribe for this and many more videos. This has been Construction Simulator. Thank you so much again for watching. I'm Bradham73, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.